Thinking about Talent LMS but not sure if it's the right pick? In this review and full tutorial, we'll look at what it does well, where it falls short, and who gets the most value from it. You'll see how fast it is to build a real course, how roles, groups, and branches work in practice, and whether tests, assignments, and reports are strong enough for compliance and scale. We'll also check the engagement side with gamification and the pricing math to see if the plans make sense as you grow. And if you want to follow along, Talent LMS offers our audience a free plan for up to 5 users and 10 courses so you can test the platform without a commitment. Before we jump in, it helps to know who can actually do what inside Talent LMS. Let's start with roles. Talent LMS keeps things simple with three default roles that shape what each person can see and do. Your active role is always visible in the header, and you can switch at any time by hovering over it and choosing a different role. The administrator role sits at the top and can change any setting, manage every course, and handle all users. Admins create and edit courses, set up groups and branches, connect people to the right training, and keep an eye on progress across the whole portal. The instructor role focuses on running training. As an instructor, you build courses, add content, enroll learners, set course rules, create groups when needed, run reports for your classes, open discussion topics, grade assignments, and schedule or host instructor-led sessions, but only for the courses you're assigned. Everything you need lives in the left navigation, so it is easy to jump between course setup, people, and reports. The learner role is all about taking training with as little friction as possible. The home dashboard shows recent activity and the day's schedule, so it is clear what to do next. The navigation gives quick access to the course catalog to find new training and to discussions to join conversations. When you remember which role you are in and switch when needed, the whole platform feels straightforward and fast to use. Now that permissions are clear, let's build something real. Time to create our first course. Creating a course in Talent LMS starts from your dashboard or the courses area, where you add a new course with a title, a short description, and a cover image. You can open the course settings from the gear icon to set a course code, choose a category, pick a certificate, and save your changes. Adding content is flexible. You can drag and drop files right into the content tab or build everything inside the editor. When you add a content unit, you can write directly in the rich text editor, format your lesson, and upload images, then use the unit options to decide how completion should work. You can embed material from the web by pasting a URL into a web content unit, bring in video by pasting a link or searching YouTube without leaving your portal, or upload files and even capture your screen from inside Talent LMS. If you need audio, you can record it on the spot and add it as its own unit. Presentations can be uploaded and converted into online content that learners can click through and you can gate progress by asking a question before learners move on. If you already have interactive packages, you can upload SCORM or TIN CAN X API files and rely on their built-in completion rules. For units that should open in their own window, use the three dots menu, choose unit options, and switch the display to a pop-up. You can also generate content with TalentCraft, the AI builder inside Talent LMS. You can start from a blank canvas and use interactive components, import a document and let AI turn it into a polished lesson. Generate new content from a quick prompt or jump off a ready-made template. After AI creates your unit, you can tweak the copy and layout, then preview to see it exactly as learners will. When your lessons are in place, set up course completion rules from the Rules and Path section. The default is to complete units in order and finish all units, but you can add prerequisites, change scoring, and tailor the path to your program. Enrolling people is straightforward from the Users icon, where you add learners to the course with a click. When everything looks good, publish the course so it's live for your audience. Lessons are live, but do they stick? Let's add tests and find out. Tests in Talent LMS help you check how learners are progressing inside a course. You add a test from the course editor by choosing test from the learning activities, then give it a name and start adding questions. You can pick from several question types like multiple choice, fill in the gaps, ordering, matching pairs, and more, so you can measure knowledge in different ways. Building a multiple choice item is simple. You write the question, add the possible answers, mark the correct one, and attach feedback or tags if you want to organize your bank. Matching pairs works the same way. You set the prompt, define the pairs, and save with optional feedback and tags. If you already wrote questions in other courses, you can pull them in by choosing existing questions and selecting what you need. Questions can be reordered with a quick drag and drop to fine-tune the flow. Test options live under the three dots menu on the test unit, where you set things like the time limit, the passing score, and other rules. You can add extra security by requiring snapshots during the attempt or protecting the test with a password. There is also a waiting tab that lets you decide how much each question counts toward the final grade, which helps you emphasize what matters most. Save your settings and the test is ready for learners to take. Quizzes check memory. Assignments test real-world skills. Let's set one up. 
Assignments in Talent LMS let you create real-world tasks for learners to complete and submit. You add an assignment unit inside a course, give it a name, and write a short description that explains what you expect. You decide how completion works from the assignment options, choosing between instructor approval or automatic completion when the learner uploads their work. Learners open the assignment and can respond in several ways. They can type into a text box, upload a file, record a video or an audio clip, or capture their screen to show their process. They can also edit their submission until an instructor gives feedback, which makes it easy to refine work before it is graded. Instructors manage everything from the grading hub on the left sidebar. All assignments appear there, organized by learner and course, with clear labels for pending and past work. You can open a submission to view or download the file, switch tabs to see different media, add comments, assign a grade, and mark it as passed or not passed. Once graded, the learner sees the result and any feedback in their view so they know what went well and what to improve next. You've got evaluations. Now let's get them to the right people fast with groups. Groups in Talent LMS make it easy to organize people and assign training in one move. You create a group from the sidebar by adding a name and a short description, then save it and open the Courses tab to attach the courses that everyone in the group should take. After that, you add users and sync them with the group's courses so the right training appears on their dashboards. You can do this one by one or use mass actions when you are onboarding a lot of people at once. If you want learners to join on their own, you turn on self-registration with a group key from the group's info tab, set a custom key or use the one the system generates and save. Learners go to My Groups, click Join, enter the key, and they are added to the group with all of its courses ready to go. You can also auto-place new users into a default group when they sign up by choosing the default group in Account Settings under the Users tab and saving your choice. From that point on, every new user lands in the right group and gets the assigned courses without any extra steps. Using groups this way keeps course assignments consistent and saves a lot of admin time. Groups handle who gets what. Branches handle where they experience it. Branches in Talent LMS let you spin up separate training spaces under one account so each audience gets its own look, rules, and catalog. You create a branch from the admin sidebar, give it a name, and Talent LMS generates a unique URL that learners will use to access that subportal. You can add a title and description to help with search engines, then brand the branch with its own logo, favicon, and theme. Each branch can run in a different language and time zone post its own announcements, and even assign a default user type so new members land with the right permissions from day one. If you want people to get courses as soon as they join, you can link the branch to a default group, making sure the group's courses are already assigned to that branch so they appear in the local catalog. Sign-up controls are flexible. You decide whether users can register via the branch URL, allow or block email domains, and even prevent logins through the main portal so access stays clean and separate. You can add custom terms of service that users must accept on first login. If you sell training, e-commerce can be configured per branch. You choose your payment processor, enable subscriptions with monthly or annual pricing through Stripe, and optionally turn on credits so progress in gamification can unlock purchases. You can also pick a default badge set for the branch so the gamified experience matches the audience. Once the setup looks right, you add people to the branch and, if needed, assign a local administrator to run it independently. Courses are attached from the Branches Courses tab, so they appear in that branch's catalog, and you can design a custom homepage to fine-tune the experience further. From the learner's side, the journey is simple. They use the branch URL, register if it's their first visit, and are added to the branch with any default group courses ready to take. Under their profile, they can see My Branches and My Groups to confirm where they belong, and the catalog only shows the courses assigned to that branch. This structure keeps audiences separate, branding consistent, and administration tidy while giving each group a tailored learning environment. Structure is set, now let's make training something people want to come back to. Gamification in Talent LMS adds friendly competition and clear milestones to keep learners motivated. You turn it on from the admin settings and choose which mechanics to use, like points, badges, levels, leaderboards, and rewards. Points are awarded for specific actions you define, and learners see a small notification when they earn them. Badges mark important milestones and can be customized to match your branding by editing the badge name and image, then saving your changes. Learners can view all available badges under My Badges, where earned badges appear in color and the rest are grouped by category. Levels give people a simple sense of progress. You decide how leveling works, whether it is based on points collected, courses completed, or badges earned. Rewards let you turn progress into something tangible, such as discounts or special offers, so training feels even more worthwhile. 
Leaderboards act like a public scoreboard and show how each person ranks. You can rank by level, points, badges, courses, or certifications, and you pick which criteria count toward the board. Each branch has its own leaderboard, so competition and recognition reflect the activity inside that audience rather than the whole organization. If you need to clean things up, you can reset gamification stats in a few clicks. You choose whether to reset everything or just badges, points, or levels, and you select which users are affected before confirming. With these options in place, Talent LMS makes it easy to add a playful layer to training that nudges learners to stay active, reach milestones, and come back for more. Engagement looks good, now let's prove impact. Reports turn activity into insight. Reports and talent. LMS give you a clear picture of training activity across your portal. As an administrator, you open the reports area to see an overview and switch the time frame to daily, weekly, monthly, yearly, or any custom range that fits your needs. You can dig into almost anything, including users, courses, branches, groups, and specific learning activities like SCORM packages, tests, surveys, assignments, and instructor-led sessions. If you want to focus on tests, you filter for test reports, pick the test you care about, and see who took it, when they finished, and what they scored. You can open an attempt for more detail or reset progress if someone needs another try. The test analysis view shows how many learners got each question right and lets you review each response to spot tricky items or gaps. Every report can be exported to Excel, and you can schedule reports to email on a cadence you choose. You enter the frequency, the day, and the recipients, and they do not need a Talent LMS account to receive the file. You can manage everything you have scheduled from the Scheduled Reports page. If your plan supports custom reports, you create one by giving it a name, choosing whether you want a list of specific users or a view that includes their learning progress, and then setting the rules, like only active users in a given course. You pick the columns you want in the output and save it for reuse. Mass actions help you act on results faster, so you can select users in a report and send a message to all of them at once. Two more views sit alongside the overview. The training matrix shows progress across multiple courses with color indicators for quick scanning. The timeline lets you filter activity by period, event type, user or course, so you can trace what happened and when. Instructors have their own access to reports inside their courses so they can monitor performance without needing full admin permissions. With these tools you can track progress, spot issues early, and make better decisions about what to improve next. So how much does all of this cost and what do you actually get on each plan? Let's break down pricing quickly. First of all, Talent LMS offers our audience a free plan for up to 5 users and 10 courses so you can test the platform without a commitment. Paid plans start with Core at $119 a month, step up to Grow at $229 a month, and move to Pro at $449 a month with the option to add more users. There is also an Enterprise tier with custom pricing for larger needs. The site highlights a flexible user limit model that ties costs to how many people log in during a month on eligible plans. You can add the Talent Library catalog as an optional extra, and its price adjusts to the user count you choose during checkout. If you're comparing options, there are a few strong contenders worth a look. Let me show you how they stack up. LearnWorlds is an all-in-one platform for building and selling online courses with a strong focus on interactive learning and branded student experiences. You create a school, design your site with a no-code website builder, and package courses as free, paid, private, or drip-fed programs with built-in checkout and marketing tools. The standout feature is interactive video. You can import a video, auto-generate transcripts and a table of contents, add in-video questions, and then track where viewers drop off to improve the lesson. This turns passive watching into active learning without extra plugins. Assessment is flexible. You can build exams and self-assessments and issue certificates on completion. And if you rely on e-learning standards, you can upload graded SCORM packages so scores flow into the gradebook. If mobile is important, you can launch a white-label iOS and Android app for your academy, so learners have a fully branded experience on the go. The app is offered as an add-on, and you manage it from your LearnWorlds admin. Compared with Talent LMS, the two platforms overlap on core LMS needs, but pull in different directions. Talent LMS is built for corporate training teams that want fast rollout, standard support like SCORM, XAPI and CMI5, and admin controls such as SSO, branches for separate audiences, and structured reporting. LearnWorlds leans into the creator and customer education side with a polished storefront, interactive video, and native e-commerce to sell and market courses. If your priority is employee or partner training with multiple portals under one roof, centralized identity, and compliance-friendly standards, Talent LMS is usually the better fit. If your priority is crafting a branded academy you can sell with rich video interactivity and a public website, 
Learn Worlds is designed for that. In short, choose Learn Worlds when you want to run a public academy with interactive video, certificates, and e-commerce under your own brand. And choose Talent LMS when you want a corporate LMS with branches, SSO, and broad standard support to train employees, customers, and partners at scale. And if selling courses isn't your focus, here's how Talent LMS contrasts with a documentation-led tool. Trainual is a playbook-style platform that helps you document processes and policies, assign training, and keep a living knowledge base that everyone can search on web or mobile. You create subjects with step-by-step how-tos, attach videos and files, add quick tests and e-sign steps to confirm understanding, and track who has completed what, so onboarding and compliance feel organized instead of ad hoc. It also maps roles and responsibilities with an org chart so people can see who does what and how work should be done. It plugs into common tools to reduce friction. Teams can log in with Google SSO, get notifications, and share how-tos in Slack, and sync people from HR systems like ADPRUN or Paycor, so new hires show up ready to train. There are iOS and Android apps for on-the-go access to SOPs, training to-dos, tests, and policy updates. Compared with Talent LMS, the two tools overlap on basic training delivery, but point at different jobs. Trainual is positioned as an LMS alternative that doubles as your company handbook and SOP hub, prioritizing searchable documentation, quick verification, and day-to-day -day how we work clarity over standards-based course packaging. If your priority is formal courses, compliance reporting, and content built in authoring tools, Talent LMS usually fits better. If your priority is documenting processes, speeding onboarding, and giving everyone a simple place to find answers, Trainual is built for that. With the landscape clear, you'll know if Talent LMS is your best bet or if an alternative fits better.